Elena, thinking about what to say to you today has run through my mind endlessly. Then it all clicked. I am not marrying you because of the things you do for me. I'm marrying you because you're always there for me. Good days and bad days, even if you worked all day, I can always count on your love, care, and comfort every time I see you. Unless you're hungry and haven't eaten, of course. Um, <laughs> My sweet Bennett, our wedding day is so soon, and I could not be more excited to be your wife. I knew you were going to be someone special to me the day that we met in the stadium, even if you aren't ready for that yet. I appreciate how you took the time to build our foundation because I believe we are better for it. You're the most patient, kind, and loving human I've ever met, and I am so lucky to call you my husband for the rest of my life. I'll go anywhere with you in the sunlight or underneath the moon. All we have is enough. We were so happy for both of you. You make a good match. This is a feeling. This is it. Yeah. No matter how pretty it is, it's still second. With you. I feel like God has such a funny way of showing you where to look for love. Because you two grew up away, six hours away from each other. And it's crazy that you two met in such a small, small place. But for the rest of your lives, you guys will always have Bloomington, Indiana. It's all waiting for us. When we met, I needed a light in my life. And you were just that. You fixed parts of me that weren't even yours to fix. And that shows how unconditional and unfailing your love is for me. I promise to make you happy, to make you smile, to love you on the hard days, to search God with you, to hold you accountable, to be your rock, to be gentle, patient, and unconditional in my love for you, to work it out even when I don't feel like talking, <laughs> to never go to bed mad, to always say I love you, to always be there for you. I can see the honesty it's pouring from your face, yeah, never could replace, yeah, I just want to stay Bennett, I'm going to ask you a series of questions now. Just wait until I'm done, and then you can decide whether you want to say I do, okay? Bennett, to you in the presence of God and all of these witnesses here, do you desire to welcome Elena as your wife? I do. do you, no, hold on. <laughs> Not only do you promise to desire her as your wife, do you promise to love, protect, and provide for her? Do you promise to face all obstacles in your path with her, allowing her to be involved in every part of your life? Do you commit to stay with her as long as you both shall live? I do, I do. Okay, good job. Hey guys, 
guys, my name is Lily Kate. For those of you who already know me, I'm Elena's obligatory maid of honor. Uh, you might already know me from my killer looks or amazing personality. And if neither of those are ringing a bell, you might know me from my amazing ability to remember important things, like wedding rings during an actual ceremony. So where's the rings? Do we even have a clue where they're at? I guess they're Well, okay, best man. There you go. You two guys, go find the rings. This is what will make it memorable. Yeah. It's so good. <laughs> Marriage is the most precious institution that God ever created for mankind. And even if trials come, if we go back to Him and look to Him, He can polish and shape and use our lives just like gold is easily shaped to make us who we're supposed to be. So let these rings remind you of how precious you are and how precious the family is to God. We love you to the day that I die. Thank you for being my best friend, my love, and my rock. I can't wait to grow old with you and get to watch you be a dad someday. You're everything to me, and I love you more than beans. Oh, Home is not a place, it's not, it's a person. And you guys have found your home. happy you were and are the person I'm sharing my life with. Thank you for always being there for me and never going a day without checking on me. I love you so much. Let's go get married. I love you. I love you too. Well, what God has joined together, the Bible says, let no man ever destroy. So Bennett, you can kiss your bride.